Nine of Arizona sheriffs gather at the state capitol in downtown Phoenix within the past hour. Yeah, they're demanding answers about the failed fe federal government operation, Fast and Furious. Steve Kraft was at the news conference and he joins us this afternoon live. Steve. Well, the, the ATF's Fast and Furious operation allowed guns into Mexico. The ATF allowing those guns into Mexico, hoping to then track them in the activities of drug traffickers. Some 2,000 guns allowed into that country. 1,400 remain unaccounted for. I'll show you some pictures now of that operation and tell you that a group of sheriffs met here today at the state capitol, including Pinal County Sheriff Paul Babu. They're upset and they're demanding a special counsel to investigate Operation Fast and Furious to the very highest levels, saying this is not a partisan issue in their view. They believe the ATF bungled the operation and has covered it up along with Attorney General Eric Holder. Here is what Paul Babu had to say. In law enforcement, uh, this is unacceptable. The fact that our own government has given weapons, some of these weapons, not only semi-automatic, uh, some transition to fully automatic and 50 caliber rifles, rifles uh, my deputies and our deputies don't even have on the street, and they put them into the hands of the criminals that we're fighting. Here you can see some other views of today's news conference. Sheriff saying that the ATF operation has cost law enforcement lives in the United States and in Mexico, and they want Attorney General Eric Holder to face not only a criminal investigation, but possibly prosecution. Now, not present today, a couple notable exceptions among sheriffs, Maricopa, Maricopa County Sheriff Joe Arpaio and Pima County Sheriff Clarence Dupnick. Reporting live from the state capitol, Steve Kraft, Fox 10 News. Get myfoxphoenix.com on your iPhone free at the App Store and stay connected.